Hello friends, it's me, the actor who played the Maslam role in Toxic World, and I'm here to make a new video with the creator, MS Film Pictures. So that. Hello my MS fans, it's me, Zedat, the creator of the Toxic World and Changed Life series. It's great to see you again. Today I have the great honor of speaking to a very special guest. He played Maslam in our series, Toxic World, and won the hearts of many fans. Welcome, please take a seat. Thank you for allowing me to be here. I am very happy. Today I would like to touch on a topic that is very close to the hearts of many fans. The relationship between Maslam and his so-called best friend, Sadri. Many viewers are wondering if Sadri was ever really Maslam's best friend, or if he was just pretending to be. Before we delve deeper into this topic, I would like to mention that the story of this friendship is based on my own experiences. For me, the Toxic World series is a very personal story that comes from my own life. Anyway, what do you think about it? Well, this is a really deep question. In the series we see that Maslam and Sadri have a close connection, at least at first view. They have been together since school and have shared a lot. But when you look closer, you see that this friendship was never as deep as Maslam wanted it to be. Exactly. In my own story, we met at school and quickly became best friends. We supported each other and I believed that our friendship would continue even after I left school. But things turned out differently. Yes, just like in the series. Maslam truly believed that their friendship would continue even after school ended. But when he left school to work, it quickly became apparent that Sadri lost interest in the friendship. He didn't tell him directly, but waited until they parted ways and eventually ignored Maslam. It was very painful to see my best friend withdrawing and spending more time with others, especially a new friend who I named the Cram in the series. This left me deeply hurt and jealous, just as it is portrayed in the series. Yeah, and that dynamic is clear in the series. Maslam tries to save the friendship by returning to school and trying to talk to Sadri. But Sadri is very cold towards him and has already formed a new friendship. For Maslam, this was a hard time. Absolutely. It's especially painful because Sadri never really wanted to be Maslam's friend. He might have never felt the same depth of connection. In the end, Maslam had to learn to let go of Sadri, even though it was very difficult for him. That was a crucial moment in Maslam's life. Realizing that the friendship wasn't real hit him hard. He had to learn to deal with it and move on. This experience forced him to look deeper into himself and understand who he really is and what he seeks in life. It's a tough lesson but one that made him stronger. Yes, it's a very realistic portrayal of how friendships can fall apart. It reflects my own experiences, and I hope many people can see themselves in Maslam. Do you think this experience ultimately made Maslam stronger? Yes, I do. This painful experience made Maslam look more closely at himself and discover what he truly wants in life. It's a hard lesson, but one that helped him grow and become stronger. Wow. That's a very inspiring thought. Thank you for sharing such deep insights into Maslam's character and his experiences with us. I'm sure our fans will take a lot from this. Is there anything else you'd like to say to the fans about Maslam and his story? Well, I want to thank all the fans who follow the series and show so much passion for the characters. Your support means a lot to us. And to everyone who finds themselves in Maslam's story. Stay strong. Sometimes we need to let go of people to make room for true, valuable connections. Those are beautiful words. Thank you for being here today and sharing so much about Maslam and his journey.